On this week in review, February 8th, it's Movement for Movement with Aorta Cope. It's so important that our community members just move. And we recognize that sometimes surgeries have left us uncomfortable, or if we have an aneurysm, we may have certain physical restrictions. Whatever your physician has cleared you to do, just do it. We want to share with you an article from Very Well Fit written by Ann Pizer titled 10 Chair Yoga Poses for Home Practice. Yoga can not only help with flexibility, but it also can help with mental clarity and stress reduction. Simple movements can do so much. Don't forget to get your physician's approval before starting any form of exercise. To view the 10 chair yoga poses, click the link below. Next up is Topic Tuesday at Aortic Hope. In honor of Marfan Awareness Month, we want to talk about interesting information and give you a couple interesting little tidbits about Marfan syndrome. Feel free to comment below with any additional facts that you think we should know about. Did you know that Abraham Lincoln is suspected to have had Marfan syndrome or related syndrome? Also, Peter Mayhew, best known for playing the Star Wars character Chewbacca, also had Marfan syndrome. It's Wisdom Wednesday and all about music. On days where chronic illness is kicking your butt, you might feel a bit more down than usual, and it's okay if that happens. While you may not feel up to doing a full self-care routine, listening to music is something you can do while you're lying down in bed or just sitting on the couch. This is according to an article from Yahoo by Monique Viche titled 21 Songs to Listen to When Chronic Illness is Kicking Your Butt. To check out the entire list and see if any songs resonate with you, click the link below. And in honor of Black History Month, we want to share with you a wonderful article highlighting the accomplishments of the first female cardiothoracic surgeon in South Africa. Here's an excerpt from the article below from Good Things Guide, written by Brett Lindeek, entitled, Meet South Africa's First Female African Cardiothoracic Surgeon. Dr. Lindaway Sadali has broken barriers by recently becoming South Africa's first female cardiothoracic surgeon, and one of only a few on the continent. In this candid interview, Dr. Sadali talks about her amazing journey from her days herding cattle as a young village girl and the challenges she had faced as a female doctor in a specialty where at some point she was the only female in training. She also shares her love for writing romance fiction stories and the miracles that she performs at Nkosi Albert Lutelli Central Hospital, where she received her training in cardiothoracic surgery. To view the entire article, click on the link below. 